I have decided, for the sake of my own fancy, to keep this log of my final days. Should that day come, where a new elite will rise out of the remaining serfdom sheep still living in the camps, it will also serve as a guide for them, to re-establish the new world order, that we have thus failed to fully perpetuate. As for myself, I am the last surviving member of the Hidden Power. My name is Anna Louise Rothschild, and I am descended from the German contingent of the Rothschild banking family. The whole of my life has been in what was once called the United States, and so it now seems that it shall be the place of my end. It is the seventh day of the fifth week, 250 auto at chaos, and I doubt that I shall see the beginning of the next decade. What you see, whoever you are is the grand underground base that we established at the time of the human purge. It was built primarily for the defense of the elite, many of whom had been assassinated by the resistance groups at the wake of our victory. From this very room, I am able to observe all of the workers, via a series of satellite feeds, all of which redirect the signals sent from the cameras, situated in the blimps above each camp. Though since our robot enforcers have been reprogrammed to act without my command, and have a direct link to each blimp camera hardwired to their internal computers, watching these human beasts of burden toil is my only remaining source of entertainment. Our satellites, which number in the hundreds, are also capable of triangulating the coordinates of any rogue covenant keepers attempting to re-establish society by attacking our camps. Unfortunately, these barbarians have long since developed nomadic practices that make them nearly impossible to track outside the camps. They move from each abandoned town and metropolitan area scavenging for supplies and fuel. We have long lost track of their numbers, and due to their religious adherence to procreation, we fear they may eventually begin to overwhelm our robotic forces. And it is my fear due mostly to the successful assassinations of key members, within the last 50 years, that these rebels have established their own underground bases to thwart our tracking satellites. But, for the time being, our automaton soldiers have proven themselves very effective at blocking Covenant Keeper attempts at liberating the camps. It is largely due to the efforts of Ignatius Oppenheimer, the last descendant of the man who invented the atom bomb, that our mechanized forces are capable of maintaining order. By taking personality profiles of the heroes of our triumph, at the dawn of Auto at Chaos, and programming them into an elaborate series of artificial intelligence software directives, Oppenheimer essentially transferred our souls into a self-sustaining collective of machines that have since mimicked the elaborate gas system of the hidden power. In all, there are about 600 camps that are still active each guarded by a strong contingent of soldiers. Each of them, ready to kill any human being not bearing the marks of our covenant, be it the mark of authority that the elite possess, or the mark of domestication that the workers are implanted with during their youth. Perhaps, at some later time, I will elaborate on the events that led the elite to their end, a mere 245 years after seizing world power. But for now, be content to know that we have done all of this because humanity has continually proven itself to be evil unless they are kept too occupied to think or reason. We are, after all, nothing but a concoction of an eternal and godless universe, and any man who would be allowed the freedom to think otherwise would surely fall into the delusion of religion. If you are the new elite, who has come to fulfill what we failed to complete, I wish you good fortune in keeping our sheep in chains and routing out the last of the resistance. But if you be a covenant keeper, I curse you, and your god, and hope that your self-destruction will be swift, so as not to further the suffering of our Mother Earth. Thus concludes the first log of Anna Louise Rothschild, the last elite of the hidden power.